the pleading phase. So the pleadings are documents that you file with the court. Like it sounds kind of like a hard word, but basically if it's a paper that you file with the court, it's called a pleading, generally speaking. And the first pleading in a divorce case is called the petition. That's different in other kinds of areas of the law. They might call it a complaint, but like in Texas, in divorce law, we call it a petition. That's the thing that starts your divorce. And your lawyer may say, oh, we got to file the initial paperwork. That's what they're talking about. And that's the thing that gets you started. And you can't get divorced in Texas until the 61st day after that thing has been filed. And like plot ruiner, you're not getting divorced on the 61st day either. So like go ahead and like go of that goal unless you are the most Pollyanna couple there's ever been with basically no assets or anything to deal with. But like for most of the rest of us, you're not going to be divorced that quickly and you're going to move on from the initial pleading phase into the um, service phase. And some people who uh, go through this process, the service phase is like NBD, all right? You're just done quickly. For others, it can be kind of complicated because here's the deal. Just because you file for divorce does not mean actually the divorce is fully underway. It's like you've turned on the choo-choo train, but it doesn't have the coal it needs to get on down uh, the tracks. So what you've got to do is give notice to the other party that a divorce has been filed and that basically there's a lawsuit pending against them. 